Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, for another Indie Game Discovery. Today we're going to look at Shrouded Insanity Freebirth. This is a free-to-play game. You can get it on Steam. And it has awesome pixel art. It has some decent reviews. Let's check it out and see what on earth we could actually get for free. It worked perfectly. Now, if you're willing, I'd like you to sign this contract. This guy's obviously in this May. You'll freely walk the land, something that many can't say in this place. Just sign here. This is a legally binding agreement made on the day of May 18, 1987, between the representative of the Waltham Industries of the one part and blank on the other. The second party, henceforth be referenced as Velmar, will undertake the following. One. The Velmar will obey any and all commands of the representative of the Waltham Industries. Two, something written in some type of script that we can't understand. Same for three. Four, the Velmar will fulfill their obligation by devoting their full time and effort to search out and destroy the source of the fog. This legally binding document will hold and aid the Velmar until such time as to be released from the service of Waltham Industries. Um, yeah, I'm gonna refuse to sign that. Well, that is unfor- Game over! <laughs> okay, um, let's sign the contract. I like that. To start a new game, you have to sign the contract. And it even says so in the beginning. Fantastic. Now we'll explain your new abilities before we head for the manor. Take the lesson tutorial. Okay, control seems good. Examine. Your skill dodge roll will protect you from anything, but it's hard to control. Press escape on keyboard. Ah, oh, I didn't read it. I didn't get to see it. Or start on a gamepad to display controls. Okay. Okay. So we have guarding, heavier attack, raise gun, light attack, parry while guarding. Use healing injection hold to run. Use and roll. Okay. I can figure this out. Oh, what the fudgicle sauce? That thing hit me too. Okay, okay, okay. I could roll past this. Oh my gosh. If you overuse your stamina, any damage will stagger you, leaving you completely open. Think carefully and pay attention to your... Why does it do that, man? To your stamina. Okay. Where's my stamina? Okay. So it's that like green bar. How to move on? Oh, I just it. Shooting them at the right time will expose your enemy. Will expose enemies for a brutal stab. You can guard most attacks. Just don't try to guard against projectiles. Okay. So this is guard, I'm guessing. But those are birds. Whoa. I'm dead. Okay. This is hard. Um, roll past that. Okay. Okay, I like this. Oh no. Okay, so I injected myself with health. Damn. Okay, I could do this. I could do this. Let's roll past these things. Enter this thing. Block. Oh look, this is my, I rec my stuff was right here. Oh nice. Dark Souls ish type style. Can I just run past them? I don't want to kill her though. Damn. 
All right, this is difficult. This is very, 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 very difficult. What did this person say again? I forgot. If you overuse the stamina, okay. Let's see what this person said. You can guard most attacks. Just don't try to guard against projectiles. Shooting them at the right time will expose enemies for a brutal stab. Shooting them. What's my shoot button? Oh, okay. I see. Oh. Not. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, man. This game is brutal. I really want to. Oh, I thought it said I had zero. All right. This is quite interesting. You can heal and restore your stamina faster using injections. They will refill when I recall you. What? When I recall you using the contract. You can heal and restore your stamina faster during injections. Okay. You'll have to harvest croakers for their vitae. You know what to do? No. Whoa, I just press A by it. Okay, so I got some uh got some blood. It's the same people. Seek out the butlers. They hold the rare yit stones. You need them to get stronger. They might also hold the keys of the manor. Make sure you use your, your yet stones carefully as they are extremely finite. Careful though. The more you use to strengthen your body, the more sanity you will lose. Interesting. Whoa, I thought I was stuck there. Sanity. That reminds me of Eternal Darkness a little bit. Whoa. Whoa. I have to start. Don't tell me I have to start all the way from the beginning. Oh, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay. I really believe I could get through this thing really quickly, though. Whoa. All right. This is hard. But I believe it could be mastered. Controls are good. The graphics are great. <laughs> what? I have no more bullets? Okay, now I only have... Okay, so your bullets are not infinite. I did not know that, and of course, there's a little meter over there. Now, I'm not sure how much longer it'll last on this game, but I can tell you one thing for sure. That... Let me get this first. What is it I want to say? Oh, yeah. In the trailers, you do see something that, like, you have a light, and you get to extend your light. And right now, there's, like, no light. So even though it's dark... I really believe that this is just how the game starts off. Whoa. 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 Each one's like a little boss, man. Damn. This is painful. But honestly, I keep want to keep going. I feel like I'm going to keep getting better. Uh, I hate to compare everything to, to Dark Souls like this, but it does have that Dark Soulsy vibe. You know what? I shouldn't be wasting my uh, bullets on her. Okay. Because I will need my bullets for this guy coming up here. This is only the fourth screen. And it's difficult as Sherlock Holmes.
Nice. Nice. I did it. I did it. I feel so accomplished. I got a yeet stone or whatever you call it. A white stone. Um, I need bullets though. That's what I really want. I like how you can see where you die before. Again, another Dark Souls-ish type thing going on here. Roguelike. Oh my gosh, I can use that my balls. Learn to parry your enemies at the right time. This is the most crucial for success and will supply me with a lot of work. So how, how do you parry? Oh, dude, I keep forgetting to use the, the buttons on the top. Okay, so par parry while guarding. Can I just use it for an attack? Light attack. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I I, I get it now. See, I, it's hard to tell who's a enemy and who's not. Now, sleep my Valmar. Till we get to the something. Manor. The text disappears really quickly. Oh. Oh, boy. Um... Sync watch. What does that mean? Save, re rewind world. I'm guessing that that's what that means. I saved. Upgrade health for three eat stone. How can I do that? Let's talk to him first. Welcome to the Barali Manor, Valmar. Now that you are conscious again, allow me to give you a little advice to help you to fulfill your contract. Once you got accustomed to your current physical vessel, I suggest you explore the interior of the manor. The king and his four knights are here somewhere. Attempting to escape is pointless. The fog has settled in, and neither us nor the, be the beckoner can leave here. Explore to your heart's content. If you happen to fall, the contract will help me recover you. Do what you were contracted to, and slay the fog. Get to it. Okay, how do I back out from there? Um, you need three eat stones to upgrade. Where can I see my eat stones? Uh, okay. I'll just keep going. I have five bullets. Okay, so the right stick kind of gives you a little peek. Am I outside? Again? Talk. <laughs> Scary. Is this a joke? Are you supposed to make the fog kneel? Alright. If Walton thinks you're good at it, if you're a good fit, I'll help you. You need it. I can reinforce your Aito for yeet stones. thing is don't have any eat stone. oh crap that bird scared the dickens out of me all right let me, let's let's go back in here how could i oh down this way should i be scared in here i don't know man why are these lights doing these things? What the f Yes, yes, I should. Yes, I should. Yes, I should. <laughs> I can't. All right, all right. Okay, okay. I can't. Damn, I died. All right, you know what? Um, I'm going to sub this game here. You could clearly see that if for a free game, this is really awesome. I definitely want to play a lot of this. It is difficult as Sherlock. I don't know why I keep saying that. But it's difficult. And um, if that's something that you're interested in. It has that Dark Souls vibe. I'm not even trying to compare them too much like that. But it does. It's hard. I really want to play this again for free. I can't believe this game is free. I would pay money for this. Alright. Well, I'll discover another game with you tomorrow. Look forward to seeing you. Have a good one.